Welcome, welcome, welcome to another episode of 3D Boxing Podcast. It is good to be back for another episode of Quick Hits. Um, we're going to get into this Deontay Wilder thing. Wilder is accusing Fury and Usyk of cheating. This is fascinating. Um, before we get into that, please like, share, and subscribe. Follow uh, 3D Boxing, 3D Boxing Blog, on all forms of social media. Uh, Quick Hits comes at you every day, 8 to 10 minutes a day, to keep you up to date on the latest, greatest boxing news and rumors. Uh, please also subscribe to our other channel, Texas Boxing Scene on YouTube. We're lots of good content on that. It's completely dedicated to Texas Boxing, and all proceeds from that channel go to autism research and recovery. All right, guys, let's get into today's show, Texas Boxing um, – Sorry. Let's get into today's show. Deontay Wilder said, um, told Ali Sek back news um, that he thought the Fury Usyk fight was 50 50. Um, it just depended on who was going to cheat harder, which presupposes that both of them cheat. Um, <clears throat> first off, I mean, it's pathetic, man. It's truly, truly pathetic. Um, Fury beat him three times. Wilder, who I think is the number three heavyweight in the world, was incredibly lucky to get one draw. Okay, so he's 0-2-1 and and been knocked out twice by Fury. He should be 0-3. He got a draw. Okay. 0-2-1. Only two blemishes on his on his. Resume. Fury's the only guy he hasn't knocked out. He was going back. His water bottle was tampered with. His gloves were loaded. The smoke signals. It, it, it's the height of patheticness. This is pathetic. It's effeminate behavior. You lost. That's all there is to it. Fury beat you because he's better than you. And I think Wilder is a great heavyweight. I, I think Wilder, peak Wilder versus uh, peak Vladimir or Vitaly Klitschko, I'd pick Wilder to stop both of them. I think Wilder's an excellent heavyweight. He's not as good as Fury. It's just it is what it is. He's not as good as Usyk. It is what it is. To sit here and to accuse these guys of cheating just makes yourself look ridiculous. You know, the, the, the second fight, which Wilder got destroyed in, was two and a half years ago. It's almost three years ago now. The second fight's almost three years ago. February is approaching our three years. Right before the pandemic, if you remember. It's almost three years ago. It hasn't gotten over it. Then Wilder comes again in the third fight and gets knocked out again. In a great fight, floors Fury twice. Can't get over the hump. Fury stops him late in the fight again. Um, but I'm, I'm just going to, you know, read the quote here um, from this boxing scene article in, in which uh, they quote the interview with ES News. Um, when I asked who would win, he goes, I don't know. That's a 50 50 fight for me. You just never know until you get in there. Depends on who's going to cheat the hardest. They wanted to see me with everybody. Um, uh, we'll get into that. Okay. I don't know. That's a 50-50 fight for me. You, you just never know until you get in there. Depends on who's going to cheat the hardest. That's what it is. Depends on who's going to cheat the hardest. First of all, can I, can I ask you what that's even in reference to in regards to Usyk? Is that like a steroid allegation? What is that in regards to? Like, what 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 did Usyk do to cheat? I I know the ridiculous nonsense you've made up in regards to Fury's loaded gloves, smoke signals, tampered water bottle, costume was too heavy, right? Did he cheat, or was your costume too heavy? And who made you wear the costume anyway? Looks ridiculous. I mean, this this is just a weak behavior from from Wilder, right? Like, it's just a sore loser. You, you know what the answer is to why did you lose to Fury? He was the better man that night. He got me. 
That's the answer. That's the right answer. It's the complete answer. It's that's what it is. You know, and it's just a pathetic little thing. Like the guy beat you, right? Like you know, Deontay Wilder <coughs> has knocked out everyone else he ever fought, right? You know, if they all came out and said, "Well, the only reason why Deontay Wilder knocked me out was because he cheated," right? Like, 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 like if Hellenius, who got destroyed in the first round, said the only reason why I lost to Wilder is because. Uh, Wilder cheated, or King Kong Ortiz, or, or give me the, go all the way back. Uh, do a pie. He goes, the only, oh, Eric Molina, the only reason I lost is because he cheated. Right? Who was it? Do a pie went long, like 11th round, so Molina went deep in the fight, too. Uh, the only reason they won is because he cheated. They lo- He loaded his gloves, and he had, uh, they tampered with my water bottle. How much would you laugh at those guys for saying that? It would just be pathetic, right? Like so, so Wilder doesn't get a pass just because he's a, he's a great heavyweight. And he is a great heavyweight, like he is. Um, you guys, you know, he, he's he's forty three and two, forty three two and one, forty two knockouts and forty three fights. He's a great heavyweight, and I know you got his resume, his resume, his resume. He's knocking everyone out. It's not that easy. Okay, you don't see anyone else doing that. Um, and he did. So it's just three years after being knocked out the first time. Um, and, you know, the second fight's been a year and a half now. I mean, the third fight's been a year and a half. The second fight's been three years. Um, the, fir- the third fight has been a year and a half almost. It's just a pathetic little thing. Like, I mean, there's no other way to really look at this. It's just absurd. I mean, <laughs> really. And you know, Wilder's going to get in with Andy Ruiz, maybe, potentially. We don't know. Um, and, and that's a great fight. And I like seeing Wilder in the ring. He's an entertaining heavyweight, right? He knocks everyone out. You know, I, I've always loved watching his fights. But this is just pathetic, effeminate behavior. Like, you, you lost, and you need to understand that you lost. And you've lost twice. And in reality, you've lost three times. Like, I always think it's important that if a fighter gets a very lucky decision, he needs to acknowledge internally that he lost that fight. So he's not the best guy out there. Right, it, it it's one is Usyk, two is Fury, three is Wilder, and then we go you know AJ four or whoever you want to say Reese is four. But there's someone better than Wilder, and that guy beat Wilder, and, and there's no shame in that, right? Like his best just wasn't good enough to beat one particular guy. Well, it was good enough to knock out forty two other guys. Right? So, let me know what you guys think. Leave your thoughts, comments below. Please like, share, and subscribe. Um, Quick Hits comes at you every day, 8 to 10 minutes a day. Um, please subscribe to the other channel as well, Texas Boxing Scene on YouTube. All proceeds from that channel go to Autism Research and Recovery. It is January 26, 2023, uh, from Texas to the world. Thank you, and God bless. Don't miss a tweet, post, story, or video. 3D Boxing is on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Hit the subscribe button now to stay inside the ring.